Watch out for the big girl, 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 Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, Megan did finally get her number one for his on the Billboard Top 100, even though we all know it was helped by Nicki Minaj. And so, she decided on Instagram and be patty. And of course, Forbes at least has some common sense to acknowledge the fact that she needed Nicki to get the number one. So, check this out. My first solo debut number one. We made so much history with this one, girl. Do you remember we used to sit at the living room table making beats? Now we got our first number one together. Lil Ju made the beat. I think me and Bankroll got it met during an intense game of Paper Rock Scissors at a 2021 party, and we've been locked in ever since. Thanks to everyone that ran it up. I'm so thankful, so grateful, so appreciative. Hotties, we got the next album and the Hot Girl Summer Tour next. Let's stay focused and positive and keep it going up. P.S. Yes, I'm about to start playing the Heidi part. Let's get the Hennessy together. Girl, anyways, so Forbes acknowledged Nicki Minaj's impact on the success of his. And let's be real for a second. We knew without Nicki that Megan was not going number one on the Billboard Hot 100. But guess what? She did because of Nicki. So let's get into it. Forbes, Megan Thee Stallion, his debut is at number one, helped by Nicki Minaj's feud and multiple versions. Megan Thee Stallion's latest single, his debut, at top of the Billboard Hot 100, likely boosted by a feud the track Nicki Minaj sparked apparently after interpreting the song as a shot at her, prompted a social media rant and a diss track, Bigfoot by Nicki Minaj. <laughs> so to be petty er. Megan said that she got number one on the Billboard Hot 100 for his, that she would get on live and drink Hennessy through a straw. <laughs> now here's a clip of that, and then it gets to IG Live, and I'll get some more commentary. Check this out. Oh, cuz <laughs> if if we go number one, bitch, I might put the put the straw back in the fifth for Hennessy, bitch. I might have to go back to put the, the straw up in the fifth. Hot girl, girl. she said. Let's get ratchet. Let's get ratchet. Let's get ratchet. <laughs> Let's get ratchet. <laughs> Then I find it so crazy that in the same live, Megan also made a point to make it be known that even people not in her fan base was helping against number one. It mean that you couldn't even do it with your own fan base, girl. Listen to this, check this out. People who wasn't even hotties was like, bitch, we got your back. Ain't that your friend? <laughs> Well, Megan, you got what you got. You got your number one now, so what? Anyway, ugh, girl, next case. Let's get into some ratchet tea from Twitter because, baby, I was not expecting this to be on my feed this morning. For some odd reason, Drake and Ray Monte peeing pics have leaked on the internet on Twitter this morning. For whatever reason, I don't know why, but it did. And as per Drake, Drake said he was not hiding his meat from the world. He was hiding his world from the meat. 
and remind you to figure out who we did stuff on Twitter. But yeah, it's 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 show your peeing Tuesday. Apparently, what the hell going on around these parts? Um, I can't show it, but you find it on Twitter. <laughs> Today's been ratchet, but anyway, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Peace.